Good morning. Um, this is my second attempt at a video um, vlog, I guess. And my last attempt, I cannot get to upload. So this may be the first video vlog you ever see from me. Um, so uh, this is what I had said in my last one. The reason I'm doing this is just because I love to vlog. I love to share thoughts, but it is impossible for me to sit down and write something out and then get the time to go back and edit it. And it's faster. I find I can just get my point across in about five minutes. And if I can ever figure out how to upload these things, it will in fact be faster. As of right now, it's not faster because I am technologically dumb and I just want it to be easy. So, okay. So today I wanted to share a little bit about some of my vision that I have for what I'd like to do with my Stella and Dot business. Don't click end because this is good. Um, I don't know if any of you saw the link that I posted a few months ago, or maybe a month and a half ago, from um, Ann Boskamp, who has written the book A Thousand Gifts, and um, it was about the plight of the Yazidi slaves in Iraq, and it's horrific what they're going through, and so I was very touched by the opportunity for me to do something, because otherwise I felt very helpless. Um, obviously, I'm not going to be going to Iraq. Um, and I don't have, you know, any of the skills of the doctors that are doing the surgeries over there for people that need them. Um, you know, there's very little I can do except for give financially. And always, you know, that's something we want to be trying to do because we know that everything that we have is because God has given it to us. Um, you know, but there comes a point where you can't just keep making more room in the budget that's a whole nother discussion. You could, but you know what I'm saying. So, um, I went to bed feeling very hopeless uh, about the situation, but it was funny because I had just been on a conference call for Stella and Dot. And it was like, in my mind, there's these two competing sides. One is, you know, be successful and, you know, you can continue to sell and, um, share the Stella and Dot with people, which is something I honestly feel great about because, um, I love what I'm doing and people love the products and I'm making people happy. So that's awesome. But then on the other side, it's, you know, this incredible need in a country where I can do nothing. And I woke up thinking about it and it was just like right there, bam, like God was telling me, you have this opportunity to be successful in a business and that's exciting, but you need to, your success is not for your own good. You need to use it for something else. And so um, the obvious answer for me right there was to take 10% off of what I make every month and give that to, um, a charity. So for right now, it's preemptive love. Um, the, the Iraqi, uh, charity. Um, but my vision is, you know, that as other, as new things touch my heart, as I see needs here or there, um, that I'll be able to, um, you know, be flexible and, um, you know, give where I see a need. And it's been pretty awesome the past two months to be able to give for, for me what's a substantial amount um, to help these people. And so, first of all, I want to thank you, my faithful customers, for being part of that. Um, and I also just wanted to share it because I just want you to know that I have a greater vision and that I'm excited about it. Um, okay, so now let's bring it back to the... Uh, incredibly superficial side of that. So this is our new crescent necklace. Um, we had the crescent in gold and then came out with it in silver and uh, it's two-sided. So this side has some sparkle on it. This side does not. Um, I love it because it's just simple and beautiful and I just, I love the shape. You can wear it, you can, it's fully adjustable. Hold on, I'm trying to do like a mirror image here on the computer. So you can pull it up and, you know, wear it tighter, um, or you can obviously wear it lower. God, I cannot get this straight. Okay. A lot lower. Um, nope. Still just ignore me. Okay. There. Got it. Um, and then again, I showed these the other day, but since apparently that may not ever get to come across these, which side am I doing these? <laughs> this is really harder than I thought it would be. Oh my gosh. Okay. Are you, are you entertained yet with my total inability to pick which ear I'm supposed to be touching? This ear. Turn the head. There we go. Lacey can do it. 
Um, so these are the ear cuffs, and um, again, I have it this way, and then there's sparkle on the back if you want to wear them that way. Um, and then there comes with two different pairs of studs. These, which have some sparkle, you can wear them like you know vertically or horizontally. The the little bar here, I would try to turn it, but since I've proven that I am too dumb to do that. I will not. And then there's another just simple pair of silver studs. And then of course you can wear the studs on their own. So I think for $49, that's a pretty amazing value. It's basically six pairs of earrings. Okay, so if you got a link to my mystery trunk show, it's getting ready to end today. I'm gonna pull for the winner. So if you see this, you have just a couple more minutes to go and um, get something every $50, get you an entry. The rewards are right at $400, just amazeballs. Um, all right. Thanks for watching. Until next time.